We begin tonight with this developing story where the dramatic rescue of a 75 year old Riverside hunter. He was lost in the mountains of eastern Tulare County since Sunday. And we want to give you a look here at the before and after photo of Juan Velasquez. He was found by a close family friend early this morning. Our Ben Morris with more on the miraculous rescue where time was running out to save his life. 75 year old Juan Velasquez and his hunting partner took off from their campsite in this remote area of Tulare County here on Sunday for what they thought would be an hour long hunt and it turned into a days long fight for survival. What started as the typical yearly family deer hunting trip for Riverside resident 75 year old Juan Velasquez at 6,000 feet in the mountains of eastern Tulare County turned into a four day ordeal with only his wits standing between survival and a lonely death in the wilderness. The amazing story started to unfold last Sunday. My dad told him, you know, stay right here. Let me go on this side, you know, and let's see if I can find anything and, you know, kind of, you know, make noise so that the animals can go your way. When my dad came back, um, he wasn't there. Maria Martinez's father was the one with Velasquez. She says they split up as her father tried to help drive deer toward Juan, who suffers from knee and back issues. That's when he found himself trapped by the treacherous terrain with only one path to potential safety. He knew he couldn't turn her up and go up. He decided that path of least resistance, I'm going to go ahead and follow us down to the ravine, to the river, Ruby's, Ruby Creek, and that's essence what he did. As search and rescue operations got underway, Maria Martinez's brother Ignacio Saldana, also from Riverside, was on a trip in Mexico when he heard the news. Saldana, an ultra marathoner and trail runner, came straight home, grabbed his gear and GPS tracker and messenger, and headed into the mountain to help search crews. Saldana was with his father and a friend on Wednesday when suddenly they spotted smoke. They knew it had to be Juan. Thursday morning, he sent a miraculous message. Sure enough, 7 o'clock this morning, he sends us a GPS you know, message you know, saying, I found him. Take a look at these amazing images. The one on the left was provided by the Tulare County Sheriff's Office. It shows him before he got lost in the wilderness. The one on the right shows him being found after spending four days alone in the wild. Take a look at the triumphant reunion of the 75 year old hunter surviving on his own and the men who risked it all to save his life. Ignacio relayed their coordinates to those crews and a CHP chopper airlifted Juan out to safety. With a storm on the way, time became the most precious commodity. Uh, if this one went a couple more days with his age and the no food and all that, it probably would, it wouldn't have ended well. Okay, I'm just being honest with you. We have a storm coming this weekend. We have snow expected to fall. Tulare County Sheriff's Office wants to reiterate, if you're ever coming to a remote area, no matter what, always come prepared and have a way for them to find you. So a similar situation like this doesn't happen to you or worse. Reporting here in Tulare County, Ben Morris, KC24, local news that matters.